your brother, brother to Joey, and we were co-best men. I did stand a little closer to him during the ceremony, so we just came up. Just a little, yeah, just a little, a little on the other side. So this place, Lake Tahoe, means a ton to our family. Uh, Catherine's family as well. We've been coming up here for decades. It's a tra tradition that started by our grandpa Fontana, um, I believe. So it really means a lot. And in fact, our parents got engaged up in Eagle Lake. So it's really fitting for Joy and Catherine to get engaged in the shores of this beautiful lake as well. Um, but then, of course, they decided to have their wedding up in Lake Tahoe, which, again, made a lot of sense, right? So much tradition, history with our family here. It just, it was right. So they did that, that was great. But now it's starting to seem like, well, are you guys showing up mom and dad a little bit? Well, <laughs> then, here we are, a year later, again, for wedding number two. So, on the scorecard right now, we had an engagement from parents. You guys got engaged and now have had two weddings up here. <laughs> so you guys are blowing them out of the water at the moment. However, Dad, wherever you are, I do have a way for you to get back in this competition. I know you've been looking at some looking at some boats. Yeah. So just these, you know, a way for us to get out in the water a little bit more and get out in the, you know, enjoy that. So just move the thought. <laughs> so Joey, for a long time, was my youngest brother. Will came along when I was 13 years old. So our relationship was oldest brother and younger brother for a long time. And as a result, I got in trouble a lot. <laughs> now most of that was my doing. However, he was the one that, you know, the one that spilled the beans on what I was doing and caused me to get in such trouble. Uh, I remember at my wedding, he said, you know, being the youngest brother, he hopes that, you know, he, he did. He taught me a lot through life and I hope I taught him a lot through life as well. But he told me, Hopes he may be a bit better man as I got older, and you did. But in turn, I hope I taught you to be a better man by leading by example of what not to do through life. <laughs> and, I think you've really, and I do. I think you've taken that and uh, <laughs> you've avoided making some of the mistakes I've made. You know, whatever that may be, whatever you've told tattletailed on me throughout the years. And here we are. So it's you know, it was great having him as younger brother growing up. However. We come from a family of four boys, and I did always want a sister. Catherine, that's when you come into play. <laughs> so you came into the family, and the dad mentioned this a little bit last night, where Joy would rattle off different facts that Catherine, of course, called him out on. But the nice thing is, as well, is you kind of came to my defense you know, a lot of time, whatever it may be, which I didn't have growing up, but Pat didn't come to my defense. Will didn't come to my defense. And while I was maybe in the wrong most of the time, it'd still be nice to have somebody come to my defense. So I really appreciate that you coming into our lives and, and being that sister for me through, through the years up to this point. I do want to say one more thing about Joey because um, my grandparents, mean a lot to me as they do to all of us. And dad last night was sharing pictures and photos of Joey wide mouth gaping during a bunch of family photos. And I don't know why that stopped. Uh, maybe it's a good time to bring that back. Yeah. Yeah. Photo opportunities. Um, however, you know, you being the youngest for a while, I believe Grandma Clarine, Clarine was the youngest too, right? Yeah, so you guys definitely kind of had that same kind of like Hey, I'm the you know I'm the youngest like the party. I'm gonna bring smiles. I'm gonna bring the laughter, and I think that uh, it, it's really wonderful that you're carrying on, you know, your tradition of clearing hall, and, and I hope that uh, you know it's not something you take lightly because I think uh, me personally I see a lot of her in you. So thank you for that. Yeah, so I'm gonna kind of finish up here by saying again that this place means a lot to us. Um, we developed relationships with our grandparents with a lot of our aunts and uncles, our cousins, and uh, we really just enjoy being up here throughout the years and getting the bond in situations, you know, whatever comes up, whether we're out there, I, whether if I drop a paddle in the bottom of the lake and I'm too scared to swim down and get it, I believe I was called paddle boy for a solid year or two. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was, uh, you know, it's so scary to do Tahoe Tessie's down there. You don't want to be messing up, you know, messing around with Tahoe Tessie. But it's, uh, this right here, I think is probably, among the tops, because now we have so many new friends and family to share our experience and our love of this place with. And really, um, I appreciate everyone being here and getting to meet some new people. I've really enjoyed getting to know Vic, and uh, he's been <laughs> tremendous fun to hang out with for a couple of days. So it's been, it's been really wonderful. So uh, with that, 
Um, one of my favorite lyrics of all time is Keith Urban. It's just a whiskey glass if you ain't making a toast. So let's go ahead and raise these up real quick. And congratulations, Joy and Catherine. You guys are going to be in this for the long haul, and we are so proud of you. <laughs>